y'all this is joe and today i have two things that i'm putting in this video that i know you're going to love the first thing is just looking at different body types i'm talking about my body type and then i'm talking about my friend kara's body type and how trying on the same thing how it looks different on us and what um, we should think about and do when we're trying on clothes. So I want to share that with you and then a continuation of my shopping trip with my friend Kara uh, where we're going into Marshalls to look for a few dresses for summer. I want to share that shopping vlog with you. Now one of the things that I saw that I wanted to share with you is that um, I feel we have amazing body types and I just wanted to show something really interesting that I found. Um, my friend Kara is about 5'10", and she's a size 8 to a 10. I'm a size 5, 5 and a half, and yes, a half matters. And I am also a size 8, size 10. She's more so 10, I am more so 8, but we basically wear the same size. So let me share a little bit about my body type. I have, um, I would say, an hourglass um, body type where my shoulders and my hips are basically on the same level. My waist comes in. Um, the difference for me is I have a bigger chest. My chest size is a 32H. So I have to be really careful when I'm wearing tops, making sure that there's no gapping. Sometimes I might wear something that um, is fine for others, but it looks as if all you see is chest. So I have to be really careful what I am wearing. Even though I might have the, um, the best body type, um, it's not always the case because of my chest. Okay, so let's go to my friend Kara. My Kara, Kara also has an hourglass figure. Her shoulders and her hips are on that same level and it comes in at the waist. She though ha is 5'10", I'm 5'5 five, five and a half, and she has a longer torso. And so things that look great on her might not look great on me and vice versa. She has um, a smaller chest than me, and so she does not have the same problem in regards to gapping or tightness around the chest. Um, but her arms are a little bit bigger. She has some muscle in her arms, and so her arms are bigger than mine. And so things that look are fine on me in regards to the arms are a little bit tight on her. And so it's so interesting how we have the same body type as an, an hourglass figure, uh, but the clothes fit differently on us, definitely due to her height and due to my chest area. Now, I want to show you this dress. I love these two dresses. I actually ended up buying one of the dresses, um, but there were two amazing dresses. So the first one that I tried on was this beautiful dress that was a, with long sleeve and it had a um, gathering at the waist with a little belt buckle and then it ended at the knee. It was a straight dress that ended at the knee. I love this dress. But I felt my body type, because of my chest, I felt like I had no waist. Like, okay, so I had a waist but there wasn't a big um, separation between my chest and my waist. And when my friend Kara tried on the dress, like she has a longer torso. And so there it was her chest and then she had a longer space between her waist and the chest. And I find that I, I like the way I looked in it, but I just wasn't feeling it. I didn't like the fact that there was no separation between my chest and my waist. I wanted a little bit more. And because I'm bigger chested, some of that was hidden under the chest area. So for me, when I looked at that dress, I felt that she, it looked better on her because she had a longer torso. And so there was her chest, then her long torso, and then her waist. So there was a bigger gap between her chest and her waist. 
Okay, so then we tried on the dress that I'm wearing right now, another dress. It's a shirt dress. It's a long sleeve um, and you can roll it up to show um, your arms. Really soft, beautiful. And I tried it on and I loved it. I felt it fit me perfectly. Um, there was a tie that you can use or you can use another belt, one of your belts that you might have at home, which might be better. And it fit perfectly. Now the sides come up a little bit, but it's not that bad. Like I don't feel like I'm showing anything or anything will be shown or it's a mini. It's just a really comfy, soft jean dress. So now Kara tried it on, being 5'10", it's a little bit shorter and you can see the difference in this dress. So in the front, it was a little bit higher, but it was okay in the sense of it wasn't showing anything, but on the sides, it really went up higher on her thighs because it was shorter on her. So she did not feel as comfortable wearing that dress than I did because I am five inches lower than her. So it's so interesting how there is this um, kind of differences in all these body types. They're all beautiful, all amazing. And it was just as we are looking for new things and we try on new things, we need to remember that our bodies are different and it fits us differently. But it's important to try things. And even if you think, oh, I don't think it's going to look good on the hanger, when you put it on, it might be different. So we just saw Kara and myself in, this, in the same two jean dresses. We wear the same size, which is between an eight and a 10. And she's 5'10", as I said before, and I'm 5'5 five, five and a half. So now I wanna show you someone who is a little bit shorter than me, have a different body type, and we are basically the same dress size. So we are size eight and 10 again. And we are showing you um, a pair of beautiful slacks that we got from Ann Taylor. These are awesome, Ann Taylor Loft. These are awesome summer. There's it's cotton, maybe a little bit of linen. Just a really wonderful pair of pants. I'm wearing it in the green. And uh, my sister, who's going to be showing you the other pants, is wearing it in a blue. Now, please do not look at our shirts. It is not matching. I just wanted to show you uh, a video of us and just to show you what it looks like on two different body types. My sister has a pear shape. Um, but it's slightly different. She doesn't have a huge amount of hips. The issue with her is her butt area. She has a really nice butt, which I've always wanted, by the way. But because of that, um, her, her bottom is a little bit more heavy than the top part of her. Okay, so let's see what it looks like. She's wearing a size 10 and I'm wearing a size 8 in the same type of pants. something really crazy that's why it's so important to just try things on right now I am wearing a uh, cream pants the same pants that I was wearing in the green in a size 8 I'm wearing it in a size 10 petite what I like about the petite with these pants is that it is uh, it is at my ankle so it's an ankle length pants on me with a petite and so therefore I can wear sandals and, and um, sneakers. I don't have to worry about it dragging on the floor because they're a good ankle length for me, which I love. So uh, basically this pants I can wear with sneakers, I can wear with sandals, and just um, with an awesome t-shirt or a, a sweatshirt and go and run some errands in it. So I love this. So here's something I want you to think about is Hey, if you see something in a petite or in a long that you can tailor it if you need to, if it's too long, or um, you can wear it instead of with heels, you can wear it with sneakers or sandals. Another thing to think about when, you, when you're dealing with petite, because I don't have a long torso, I have a shorter torso, um, petite fits me okay. 
I feel a lot of times if you are five, five and above, sometimes petite doesn't fit as well because the um, crutch area, it might be a little bit tight and snug for you if you have a long torso. So that's something to think about. That's why you want to try things on, okay? We need to remember that our bodies are different and it fits us differently, but it's important to try things and even if you say, oh, I don't think it's going to look good on the hanger, when you put it on, it might be different. So I want you to go out and try things and know that there is something for you out there. There was something for her. This The first dress was beautiful on her. And there's something for me. I found this awesome jean shirt dress that I just loved. I've been wearing it. This is the second time I'm wearing it. And I got it last week. So now we're going to go into just a few things that we picked up at Marshalls. These beautiful dresses that we found in, in there. So I want to share this um, kind of shopping vlog with you. Hope you like it. Yeah, so you can make it how you want it. This dress feels super comfortable and like a good everyday like. Yeah, you can wear, wear this to work. Yeah. You can wear this to the supermarket. You can wear it. Just put sandals on. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. Can I take a picture of it? Sure. Okay. But I feel like it's a little, it's a little prettier than um, yes. Than the well, I think it's a little dressy. Yes. I don't know if I can. And it's a medium? Probably. Okay. But I do like it. I do like, I like it. And I it's a little it's, dressy. I think it's the dressiest dress that we found. Yes. So yes. My, is it okay? No sleeves. Um, it is a bit much with like the leaves and the purple. <laughs> but what about the silhouette? If it was a, it wasn't yeah, as tight. Yeah. Isn't so it pretty? I think you would shy away from this. I, oh, the shape of it? Yes. Um, I actually, I mean, like, if it were actually comfortable, I wouldn't mind. Okay. But this is not comfortable. Okay, this is really pretty though. Yes, the I materials. Do, I do like comfort overall, that is true. Yes. But, um, it's a little I, bit tight, that's why. So that's I comfortable. actually have a little pencil skirt that I just love. It fits like this. It's like got a, a nice, like because a lot of times it's really short for yeah. you, and this fits you that's, right there. It's very comfortable. I know, especially when it's really it's hot. Nice. Like night. Oh, that's sold, <laughs> sold. <laughs> yeah, and I like the color too. It's very yeah, light it's linen. So you can throw that on, go to the market, just throw on your flip, you know, your sandals. Yeah, it's casual. It's not it dressy, yeah. but that's yeah, cute. it is casual. It's not super dressy, but I. My arms. Right. <laughs> key, key, key. Yeah, but I do like it. More dressy than the last. Yes, one, correct. And it's so interesting. I think it's the color. Well, it being a plain color. Maybe. Yeah, maybe it is. And the, the neck is also higher. Yeah, I really like this, and it's a really good look on you. Yeah. Do you think I could wear this to church? I think so. It's long enough, it's covering a lot more of your arms than the other one. So that's it. I hope you enjoy this video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button. I would love to, to share with you new things. If you have any ideas of what you want to see on this channel, definitely sh um, shoot me um, a note in the comments and I will try to get a video out there for you. All right, bye.